As the economy grapples with canceled flights, vacations, conferences, sporting events, and supply chain disruptions because of the global outbreak of coronavirus, Tesla CEO Elon Musk took to Twitter with his take. Musk wrote last Friday that the coronavirus panic is dumb. One Twitter user wrote that it has been blown way out of proportion, and another wrote that it's dumb to panic, but people should always be prepared for a pandemic or natural disaster that requires them to stay inside. More than a million people liked the tweet by Musk, which comes after multiple companies in Silicon Valley curtailed travel plans and urged workers to stay at home as the virus continued to spread in the U.S. So how does the stock market view the coronavirus? Let's take a look. Well, this was today's take by the market. And at the lows today, this was the market's biggest down day since 1987. And I can remember those days like it was yesterday. But by the close, it was only the biggest drop since October of 2018. This is the only day in the history of the S&P 500 futures that they gapped down more than negative 5% and didn't close above the open. And how about this? Total U.S. trading volume on a 10-day moving average basis is now higher than during the meltdown in 2008. Volume was another whopper today with over 17 billion shares traded. And, of course, extreme fear has reached its most extreme level, as shown by this chart. Again, in the lower portion of the chart, you can see that volatility and fear may last longer, so be prepared. And today, I have another list for you. And for those of you who find today's market stressful, I want you to focus on a few things. Number one, somehow distract yourself from the headlines. Do what you need, but don't pay attention to the media. For me, it's an evening walk with my wife and our little pit bull. Take another look at your budget and make sure you have a proper plan. With the health issues front and center, Make sure you can come up with some money in an emergency. That was number two. Number three, check in with elderly family and friends. The elderly are more prone to health issues. Even if you had a bad day in the market, someone else may be worse off than you. Take some time out and help someone. It may help you more than you know. Number four, once again, be careful of where you get your news. Fear sells. Don't be pulled into the fear trap. Number five, organize your finances and pay off debt. Get your finances in order. If you can't do that, you shouldn't be in the stock market. And as a side note, margin debt is forbidden on this channel. Number six, and lastly, if you're active in this market, this is an excellent time for you to amp up your retirement accounts. That's for a rainy day. And I was active in today's market, but that's for another video. And tomorrow will be a brighter day. So, for today, that's Chudog Charts. Thank you.